Welcome to Mahashivratri 2023. It's our great pleasure and privilege to have our beloved President of India here with us. Namaskar, ma'am. And uh, His Excellency, the Governor of Tamil Nadu, with us and also the Honorable Minister of Information Technology and Digital Services of Tamil Nadu State. Namaskaram, sir, please. LR Kuvanakam. Enge Tamil Nadu. Mahashivaratri. Irvati Irvati Mono. Elatake Miga Permeana. Oru Vilava Kondari Lama. In the legend of Adi Yogi, who stands here, 112 feet tall, in recognition of the 112 methods or ways, or in today's language, technologies that he offered for the subjective well-being of the human being. He offered this in three different ways for his very studious disciples, the seven sages who are today celebrated as the Saptarishis. He expounded the science and technology of it. But Parvati, his wife, witnessing what was happening that this exposition of yoga or the yogic sciences exploring the nature of the human subjectivity and also exploring the nature of the creation. She was so intrigued and saw how the seven sages were going through indescribable experiences. Then she came and said, I also want to know this, teach me. So Shiva said, you don't bother about this, you come sit on my lap. She said, that's not what I seek, I want to know. He said, it's all right, come and sit. When she came and sat on his lap, he pulled her in and made her one half of herself, himself. That is why he's Ardhanari, half man, half woman or the ultimate man, because one half of his is woman, as it is for all of us, because of what we have all come from a parentage of a man and a woman. The third group of people who always hung around him, the Ghanas, they said, what is happening to everybody? Why are we missing out? What about us? He said, you don't bother about learning, nor do I have to take you on. You just drink off me. And they went wild with ecstasies. So here we have a, a small, a uh, technologically advanced show which will be projected upon the Adiyogi, which is uh, popular here as Divya Darshanam. This twelve-minute show will depict these three ways in which yoga or the yogic sciences was conveyed to three different groups of people. Or in other words, it is not a common prescription. Teaching methods are always as per the requirement of the person who sits in front of us. Well, that is the tradition we have followed here, Adisha Yoga. We don't subscribe to any particular philosophy, ideology or belief system. It is a science of subjective exploration. <laughs> 